Hey guys, so I'm here to give a little bit of an explanation why I haven't been doing the EHP results anymore. Well, yeah, I'm still drinking the product and um, I guess I've lost a few inches, but it's not a lot, a lot. But anyways, the reason that I stopped doing that was because I've been studying for my NCLEX exam because I want to get licensed as a registered nurse and today I want to go take it and I'm pretty sure I failed it. I I was hoping to stop at 75 questions just like everybody else are like oh when you get a 75 it stops and you pass but mine kept going and going and going until I got to 147, it stopped. And the lady at the front desk, she told me, she's like, it either stops at 75 or it stops at 155. So, it stopped at 147, but I'm pretty sure I failed that. I did do the, the Pearson Vu trick that you're supposed to do. Or that you can do to try to get your results faster and I did it and it came out uh, I got a bad pop-up so I'm pretty sure I failed it and I'm very upset about that and I don't know what to do I don't know if I if I'm even I'm gonna retake that I don't know I have so much stress. I have four kids. I have a little one that's 10 months old. And studying is just so hard. <clears throat> so, I don't even know. I've been thinking about it. See if I want to cry. Or if I just suck it up. And I know my results will come back. Anytime. Within the next two weeks, maybe, I don't know. And I'm pretty sure it's going to say fail. So, yeah. So, I've been do dealing with that right now, and I feel very upset. But yeah. I really, I'm just hoping that that Pearson Vu trick is false and stuff. And I actually pass it instead of failing, but I just felt it was so hard. NCLEX is hard. It is hard. You really have to know your stuff. You have to know everything. Your labs. Infections. Isolation precautions. It's a lot. A lot of stuff. A lot of safety and I hate I hate test taking because I have such bad anxiety during um, testing and I'm pretty sure that's what got to me too I was trying to rush too because my kids I forgot today was early release and my kids are supposed to be out at one and I went past one <coughs> You okay? Uh oh, he's choking. Um, so I went past one, and then I tried to hurry up on the last few questions. That's when it cut me off. And then I went to the went to go pick him up, and then the office I got scolded by a lady because she said I need to pick him up on time. And this is like the first time that that I've done this, so you know. She could have been easier on me, but she was like, you need to have somebody to come pick them up because I can't stay here with them, okay? I was like, okay, fine. I was like, I had a family emergency. Well, it wasn't a family emergency, but it was a testing emergency. But yeah. Today was not a good day, and I feel very stressed. And yeah. So I just came here and started ranting about my life today, about my day today, because I just don't know what to do. 
I don't know who to talk to. My husband, he's very supportive. But I don't, I can't talk to him about this. I just feel so upset because he keeps thinking that I probably passed. I know I didn't. I know I didn't. Anyways, good night.